So imagine you've been given this order table and it's got about eight and a half thousand orders in it and you'd simply ask well what percentage of our sales are coming from the west region now you might be tempted to go about calculating this using some kind of formulas or filters or potentially a sum if calculation or all manner of formulas could could actually get to that result but i want to show you that using a pivot table layout you can get this value very quickly indeed. So if I click on that insert a pivot, pivot table and I just drop the region as the row and the sales as the value, so we get that. But by right clicking on that sales value, you can put show value as percentage of grand total. And all of a sudden now, you can see straight away, we've got 24.12% of our sales are in the West. That is an incredibly fast way, and it shows the pivot table power, really. Incredibly fast way of answering a question like that, and you don't even need to use any formulas. Now, there are all sorts of different options in here, and the, by right-clicking on the numbers, you can see straight away you've got a summarize values by, which you can have sum, count, average sales, for example, max sales, min sales, all very useful. And then for each one of those, you can show those values as these various different percentages or differences or rank them for example now no calculation will just give you a sum normally so you might want to for example show a count so if we say or average sales for example so we put on average sales but we don't want that as a um, percentage of the grand total We've got average sales here. Now we might say then, okay, perhaps we want to show those values as rank from smallest to largest uh, based on the region field. Yes, that would be good. And there you go. And we can even sort this, to be honest. If we just click on that and sort smallest to largest, we now have a ranked list of regions by average sales. Again, something that would take a very long time indeed using formulas. I mean, this is the kind of thing you can do whilst you're actually on the phone and somebody's asking you these questions. You can be you can be doing this with a few clicks of the mouse. Phone in the other hand, you certainly couldn't be doing that if you were using formulas. You can download the very spreadsheet I'm working on by clicking in the link below and use the data to practice on. You've been watching John on Up for Excel, where I'm going to help you get your Excel skills up so you can get these tasks times down.